As noted in the learning materials, the roller claw relies on some sort of elasticity to maintain friction. Either the object needs to give, or the claw does. This particular type of claw allows for very quick pickup of game objects without a requirement for fine positioning. If you're the robot driver, you just need to turn on the roller, touch the object with the front of the roller, and it will suck the object in without any further control. As we can see in this Autodesk Inventor model, this particular type of roller claw is set up using gear feeder wheels. The gear feeder wheels are driven by a larger wheel and motor, and they're driven by a chain on the sprockets. For this game, a ball was sucked into this particular mechanism, the arm was raised, and then the reverse process. The motors were reversed, and the ball was dropped into a hopper.